everyone. Nice to meet you. So today I will tell you about the Ready, Freddy, Don't Sit on My Lunch, Chapter Six. Okay, let's go about it. Okay. It's Chapter Six, and I need to tell you about a flick of the wrist. The me the flick means very quick, all right. And wrist means ankle. Okay, let's read about it. The night at dinner, I was so excited that I couldn't stop thinking about hockey. Jessie's a good, Jessie's a really good teacher. Dad, she taught me a lot today. Well, that's great, my dancer. Like what? Well, she taught taught me how to shoot. How to shoot the puck. She said you have to flick your wrist and said, picking up my knife to. Demonstrate. Oh, sorry. Because I really, actually don't know. Demonstrate means so. If you know, then can you write in comments, please? Thank you. Okay, like this. He shoots. I flick my wrist, and a big lump of mashed potatoes went sailing across the table. And splattered right in Susie's face. He scores! Ew! I screamed as as she wiped potato off her eye. You little right, you little brat! I'm going to get you for this," she said, lunging across the table to grab my shirt. A large bowl of peas fell off the table and spill spilled all over the floor. Let's all calm down," my mom said. Scrabbling to pick up the piece. Just look at the mat. This mess. Calm down. Calm down. Susie screamed. That's easy for you to say. You don't have mashed potato in your eye and up your nose. Let me help you wipe it off. My dad said. Freddy, not how many times have I told you not to play with your food? I wasn't playing. I was just trying to show you how Jessie taught me to flick my wrist. Well, no more demonstrations, my dad said. Susie, why don't you go wash the pota potato of your face, Freddy? I think you should say you're sorry to your sister and help your mom pick up the piece. Susie did. Freddy, my dad, don't argue with me here. Or you won't playing hockey at all. But then, no buts. We have to help your 
mother now. I bent down to help. You know, mom, if we had a dog, we wouldn't have to be cleaning up this right now. A dog is like a vacuum cleaner. If anything spills on the floor, the dog licks it right up. How many times do I have to tell if you're not getting a dog? They're dirty and smelly and they shed. I'll clean my own floors, thank you very much. I shuddered. Oh well, it was Worth a try. My dad leaned over and whispered in my ear, She's sweating. You try out for hockey. You're lucky you got that. Just then, Susie came back from rushing her face. She stood over me with her hands on her lips and cleared her throat. Uh, hmm. Yeah, what? I asked, looking up at her. I'm waiting, she said. Waiting for what? For an apology. Oh, brother, I'm sorry, you little baby. Dad! Susie whined. Did you hear that, Freddy? My dad said. I want you to say you're sorry about calling your sister any names. Fine, I'm sorry. You didn't mean it, Susie said. You have to say it again. What? Say it again. No way. All right. Enough, you two, my dad said. Susie, Freddie already said he was sorry. Now, can you finish what's left of your dinner in peace? Yes, that would be nice, my mom said, pulling in her chair. Kiss it down, and no more hockey demonstrations while he, we are eating, please. When things calm down again, Susie said, Hey, I thought you We're going over to Jesse's work on some special project for school, not play hockey. Oops, in all my ex excitement, I had let it slip that Jesse was teaching me hockey. Yeah, well, we, um, so Jesse's, Jesse plays hockey, my Mom says, smiling. Now I get it. Get what? Why you want to play hockey so badly? She was not making any sense. I already told you why. Because it's a really fun sport. Right, right, she said, winking at my dad. I hate when they do that. It's like a secret grown-up code. Will you stop smiling and wanking? I said. But I think it's sweet, my mom told me. What's sweet? I yelled. I have no idea what you are talking about. You're making me crazy. I think it's cute that you have a little girlfriend. I do not have a girlfriend. How many times? How many times do I have to tell you people that? So they started singing that stupid song again. Freddie and Jesse sitting in a tree, kissing. Leave me alone! I screamed as I tried to hold back my tears. Oh, Freddie, I'm sorry, my mom said. I didn't mean to get you so upset. Some here. Come here. Let me give you a hug. I walked over and sat down in my mom's lap. 
She put her arms around me and gave me a big squeeze. Jessie, Jessie is just helping me to learn how to play hockey. I said, sniff, sniffling. I really, really, really want to be Max Sellers and get the last sport on the team. And you will mouse, my dad said. Oh, dad! I said, wiping my nose on my sleeve. Yeah? Do you think maybe you could call me something else? Mouse doesn't really sound like a hockey player's name. What do you mean? Mouse is a great name. Mice are quick. They move easily in and out of tight spots, and they almost never get caught. Just like a good hockey player. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Just call me Freddy the Mouse Stretcher. I said, I will move so fast. Then no one will be able to catch me. Not even Max Sellers. All right. So it's very short, everyone. So, so it's very short. All right. I'm sorry. Okay. So thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye bye.